Max Blumenthal is a writer who regularly takes on conservative politicians, positions, and groups. He has a new video on his website and on the Huffington Post, tracing his visit to a meeting of the College Republican National Committee. Everyone Blumenthal interviews strongly supports the Iraq War. So that we're not fighting them here in the United States. Not even just Al Qaeda, the Islamic fascism. But then Blumenthal asks something they may not have expected: Why haven't you enlisted? Why are you not fighting them over there? Why am I not fighting yeah. them over there? Because I'm in college right now. Well, I'm an undergraduate right now, and I just had a scholarship for Fort Bright Futures, and I just I didn't have any real, I just didn't have any strong urge. I don't think you can't talk about this issue if, if you're not serving. Blumenthal staunchly opposes the war. He calls his video "Generation Chicken Hawk," an ideology um, that 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 says you can support this war. Um, th which uh, is not supported by most Americans, and which uh, is wearing down the military without uh, serving in it in any way, or participating in it, or making any kind of sacrifice. Isn't it possible to absolutely thoroughly support a war but not enlist with no hypocrisy? It's possible to absolutely support a war, but at this point, uh, with the military worn thin, I think it, at this point it is hypocritical, since this country uh, probably needs them to serve. I think we should. Kind of take it for what it is, and that's a political hit piece. It's it's totally one-sided. The group's head, 25-year-old Nick Micarelli, is also in the National Guard and served in Ramadi, Iraq. People who support uh, stricter laws on and a lot of things in this in this country, and aren't necessarily willing to go become police officers. He says some college Republicans do enlist. Um, we're more concerned with what the troops think about us than what a bunch of uh, radical left-wing people think. Blumenthal, who's 29 years old, summarizes his message in this final shot and says he's had positive responses from some members of the military. Blumenthal also rejects that radical left wing label. In fact, he says a lot of Americans agree with him. He also points out that this group was training ground for the likes of Karl Rove, Jack Abramoff, Ralph Reed. So he says some of the people he spoke with might one day be very powerful. Josh Lev, CNN, Atlanta.